Hi, I'm Karen Knudsen. I'm the chair of the math department, and right now I'm teaching Math 630, which is our honors math seminar on gerrymandering. So in partisan gerrymandering and racial gerrymandering, we see the makeup of different kinds of people in different districts, and we try to quantify that and see if a district, let's say, has 90% Democrats or 10% Republicans, or 80% black, 20% white. We try to quantify these and see how it affects elections today. I got really interested in this topic last summer. I came at it from the math, but then got sort of sucked into learning uh, more of the legal and historical background. And I thought you know, it was super, super cool how it got me interested in more of the humanities side of things. And I thought maybe this could be a cool interdisciplinary experience for our students. Uh, my project more broadly is to look at Andover's cluster system as a sort of districting plan and try to see, using some student data gathered by the people at the Philippian, whether we could engineer certain cluster level election results by switching around which dorms are in which cluster. And the overarching question that I think the course poses is what do we want our districts to look like in American democracy? And instead of trying to tackle that problem through more traditional or humanities oriented routes, like a history or otherwise social sciences class might, we really try to take a more quantitative and math-based approach to attacking these softer qualities that we want for our democratic system.